star to film deep in the woods with wolf and hound we are now along this trail we've never been here before we've never been on these trails we've never been in these woods it's all no experience so what we're going to do today is we're going to take you along with us on an epic woods adventure hound well, you got anything you want to say uh, and it seems like a nice trail so far it does, and uh, it seems like a pretty nice little fishing spot right here. Hell yeah, I mean, I'm seeing all kinds of little fish swimming around over in here. Yeah, me too. Little I've bluegill, seen several. Little, I see one. Look, I see two there. right there now. There's a bass and a bluegill or brim right there. So, um, with that being said, like I said, <laughs> we haven't been here before, so... What we're going to do is follow this trail for a little ways, and which you will see some. Dot trail. We are on the White Dot Trail. Then we're going to find a random spot in the woods, and we're just going to kick it back through the woods. We're going to have a good time doing that. We haven't done that in a while, have we? We no, need to do it. A good picnic lunch. Yeah, we got ourselves a little picnic lunch. Yeah, uh, we're going to be somewhere over way off that way. Maybe. But yeah, yeah, we'll probably be yeah, on well, the we'll other have side. We'll go around and we'll be on that. Side. We'll make sure when we get over there that we let you know that hey, over here's where we filmed the intro. So we'll we'll shine the camera over this way, and um, so I hope that uh, that you enjoy this video as much as we enjoy coming out here and shooting these videos for you. Like I said, when we find these woods, we're gonna push deep in. We're gonna find a random spot with a comfortable log. We're gonna set the camera up and we're gonna have a random chat with you. We're gonna talk about all kinds of things like we normally do. We haven't done this with you guys in a while, so we love to do this type of video for you. Plus, we need a break from doing the paranormal. We've done paranormal videos, a whole lot of them back to back. and So we need to have a little break and what better break than coming out here and being in our natural environment. So, Hound, I guess, you know, normally we would say cue the music, but I think on this particular video, why we're we going to uh, have... Why don't we just... Well, that, well, that was, was an that epic, was epic fail. fail. So, how about this? Let's just take this music stick right here. Music stick? Yep, the music stick. Yep. Piss off the fish. I throw it in the water. So, uh, Hound... I guess, uh, let's present today's music. Roll them. Roll them.
Yeah, that's not a trail. That's a washout. Huh? Yeah, this is pretty through here. Sorry about the breathing heavy, folks, but that's the COPD. Okay, folks. Yep. Like I promised, I will show you. Maybe. Right over there is where we did our intro that you saw. So that's where that is. So we made it to this point so far. And. Yeah, there used to be something here. I'm not sure what. All right. F off. <laughs> I didn't hear you. Uh, here to train. Yeah, it goes through these woods. Look. Now when we get up here, there's a fork. We can either go around that way uh -huh. 
Or we can go find us a spot right here on this fucking point. I'd rather just go around that way. All right. Check it out. I'm not too interested in that steep hill, though. Hey, at least we ain't got 30-pound packs on. <laughs> Damn, that hill's a monster, isn't it? Huh? So there had to be something up here at one something. time. Something. Where? Yeah, maybe. Musky Dines, maybe. All right. Which way, Hound? Well, we go this way, we go around, we can go this way. But I think it's about time we start heading our ass in the fucking way. So you wanna go this way? Yeah, we'll start heading that way in the woods. Right. Awesome. Find us a good spot. I'm not sure, it looks like something, but I'm not sure what they are. I'm not trying to go through all that fallout, fall down, dude. I'm gonna go down here and go through. Okay. Let's go. Watch out for copperheads and rattlesnakes. Yes, rattlesnakes.
We are officially off the trail. zoomed in. Hey, yeah. All right, let's go this way now. Now, which way? That was pretty cool. I hope I was able to catch it on camera. Look, there's another one. Look. Zoom in. Hey, dear. Hey, dear. It's all right. We're not going to hurt you. We're your friends. We're friends. Hey, mama. It's okay. I can see him. It's okay. Yeah, I think this one's injured. There you go. All right, which way was we going? This way. <laughs> I was just talking about yeah. seeing some wildlife. <laughs> Dude, that's perfect. You know what I'm really looking forward to for though? Considering we're here in some time. Yeah. Yeah, I'm looking for them. It was cool seeing that deer. Yeah, let's go this way around. I hear another train. right here. That looks like a pretty good spot. Or right here. Uh, I had to do in zoom. Excuse me. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, look. Deer poo. And that's fitting because they were here. And rabbit poo. That's got to be a call a day or so old. I don't know. That looks pretty fresh. Well, we did just see those two deer, so. Nah, that's not. It's still, I can still tell it's moist. All right. All right. Well, we finally made our way to wait, the east. Wait, 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 wait. We should say this first. All right. Hello. Hello. Okay, well, we should have did that beforehand, but anyway. So we made our way down here, and... I'm a little behind the schedule. Yeah, that's usual for you. And, um, so we, uh, got off trail, and of course, you know, you've probably seen it. Well, you did. I think I actually called it, but we caught a couple deer on the way to this spot, and we found this spot, and when we choose a spot... It's a spot that we choose, that we feel in our hearts is the right spot that we should be, that the great creator has allowed us to find. So, this is one of the spots. Nice comfy logs. Yep, one of these spots. Uh, I um, mean, there's several comfy logs here in this spot. Yeah, and there's lots of pine trees and other trees around. <clears throat> so, um, I guess I'll start by saying, you know, that we talked about YouTube took a lot of views away from the full moon investigation at the cemetery, the one we did with uh, 
Krista and Kylie. But actually, right now, we're actually above where we lost. Oh, no, no. I'll tell you exactly. So that's pretty good. So I'm happy with that. Give me a second. I'll tell you yep. exactly. Actually, it was at 138 when YouTube decided to be funny to and take drop our it all the way down to 80. And right now it's at 160. So 160. it's got 30 over. So that's really good. We're really pleased with that. Um, so that's awesome. Um, like we was saying, you know, we decided to come out and shoot this particular video. Well, one, we miss being out here. This is something that. What you're seeing now is something that I've done my whole entire life. He's done his whole entire life. Um, you know, we're we were born and raised out in rural Rowan County. So I mean, you know, why other kids was playing on basketball courts and parks and stuff. Man, I spent the majority of my childhood hiking around in the woods. And it's a part of me. It's a part of who I am. I feel comfortable out here. I could stay out here for days on end. Um, so that's why we wanted to shoot this video. Plus, we have done a lot of paranormal videos in the past couple months. So we needed to take a break from that. Uh, we will be doing another paranormal video. Of course, you know, Halloween's coming. So we have our Wolf and Hound Halloween special video that we'll be filming. And that's going to be awesome. Man, I just, I love the sounds of nature, man. It just, uh, it does my soul is, good. It does my heart is. good. So, um, I guess we have several things to talk about. Um, since the last time we shot a video like this, you know, we only had like 1,000 and some subs. Now we're uh, almost at, uh, we're one away, I think. From one, 2,140. Yeah, so that's pretty Very good. We're good. really happy about that. And uh, we're climbing up in the views on our view count. Last time I checked, it was like 322,000 and some. Uh, we got over 700 uploads altogether. And so that's not... How rude. That's what she said. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I guess they got a lot to say. I know you can hear it on the camera. So we're really pleased at where we are. We get aggravated sometimes because when we feel like YouTube yeah, does that, are. it's a slap in the face. But since we did our last In the Woods video, which I believe we were sitting on the rock, uh, we are no longer monetized. Um, Truth be told, we get to we get to reapply when November to November, I believe thirteenth. We can reapply, and we are going to do so. We are going to do so, so. Just keep your fingers crossed on that. Maybe yeah. they all won't be bitches and take our shit and not give it to us. Yeah, maybe so. I mean, who knows? If not, we can still fall back on our Patreon whenever we decide to do that. If if we decide to do that at all, uh, we kind of like what we're doing. Uh, so, let's talk about some of the things that oh, have happened in this in the past several months. Of course, you know, since we did our last in the woods video, you know, we we've, we've had to leave our home in Mooresville and we come to live at uh, Lost for Words house with her and Brian. Um, they gave us a place to live, so we have the Wolf and Hound compound. Uh, they're awesome guys. They're funny. Brian, Brian, that dude just makes me laugh all the time. He he's just got one of them sense of humors that I know that he gets us. You know what I'm saying? And because like he has his, that I like same, his dirty sense of humor. Yeah, me too. I love his dirty sense of humor because I'm about as a dirty old bastard as, as anybody else. Oh yeah, I got a pretty nasty dirty sense of humor too. So, so um, that fits in well with us. So we're getting to know High Point pretty good. Uh, we're starting to know all the ins and outs, how to get to places. Uh, we went to this park. Hey. Hey. Don't. I think it just said your man. Um, 
So anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna have to go find Bacarl and sick Bacarl on you. So anyway, um, so we went to this park the other day to fish, and um, and we decided that we really liked that place. And we will be going back. Oh there yeah, they got year morning. long. They got year long camping, all year long, so we can actually do some winter camping because that's just something that I like to do. And well, uh, the best thing is. The fishing's free. Yeah, the fishing's and free. And there's four different lakes and ponds you can go. And they got endless go trails and stuff. So I mean, old we can buildings, go there. Old buildings, an old tobacco barn, an old yeah. schoolhouse, old cabin there. Yep. And uh, I finally got the oil changed in the truck. Uh, last time I changed the oil was in February. I know. Wait, wah, wait, wah, wait, wah, wait, wah. wait. Yeah, we should do that, but I think we should pause for the applause. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> so anyway, the truck's got fresh oil in it. Uh, let's see what else is going on. Yep, Brian asked the uh, Lost for Words to marry him, and so so that's gonna be happening in uh, next September. So I guess so we, we should uh, take a pause for the applause. Yeah, for pause that one. for the applause. <laughs> Oh, okay. this thing with Jenny Love uh, that she invited us to do. Oh, yeah. That's going to be so freaking epic. I forgot, I'm, wasn't that supposed to take It's start. supposed to start in November. And I cannot. Am I supposed to start this? I guess. I cannot wait to do that. And so, if Jenny Love, if you're watching, if on season two, if you need fill ins, then me and Hound are happy to to do that because you know I mean we do these little crazy challenges and blindfold challenges all the time and stuff yeah, what up. so I'm really looking forward to doing that right, what about you crows are fucking with me. <coughs> so anyway um, they're being rude and I want to talk about I want to talk about you know what I want to talk about Hound? I want to talk about Kylie I want to talk about her and what a phenomenal little ghost hunter she is turning out to be. I'm very pleased. And what did she, she tell did. us? What did she tell us in that dark cemetery? What did she say she wanted to do? She wanted to do a blindfold she challenge. She wants to do a blindfold challenge. That is freaking awesome. So, you know, you, you know how we feel. If a kid has a dream... I mean, she wanted to have her own little chat with the spirits. With the spirits. So she did and a phenomenal I mean, job. she's a lot like her mama, uh -huh. you know, and... Uh, so we are uh -huh. honored to to share these experiences with these children because after we're gone and, and most of you you know we're getting up there in these years now most of of you paranormal investigators including myself uh -huh. these are the these are the the folks that are going to take over uh -huh. Oh, Once well, we can't do it anymore. Final, like, done, said, and gone. I gotta have somebody to fill your Yeah, slot. like if something was to happen to me, and I couldn't do it no more if I got sick and I couldn't do it no more, or you know, God forbid, I, I, you know, passed away or something. You know, Hound's gonna need somebody to step in. You know, and of course, you know, I ain't trying to brag, but can't nobody be like Wolf. But, but, and, and that's even besides the point. The the point is, is that you know. When a kid has an interest in something, I think, and you do that very thing that they have an interest in, I think you should include them. <coughs> and, um, you know, Kylie's pretty amazing because she's investigated <coughs> the abandoned hospital with us, and so has the Littlest Ghost Hunters. You remember that night, the last night we was there with them, we had to evacuate them out because we started getting demonic responses. And once we start, you know, getting into darker responses and stuff, Everything stops. The only thing that is important to us at that time is the safety of the children. And, and so we have to get them out of there as quick as we can. You know, then the video's over. Yeah. You know, and that's just the way it is. But <coughs> this video with Kylie the other night at the cemetery, it just seemed like that they were really interested in her and they wanted to talk to her. And I think there's a little boy spirit there, you know, that was really interested in her and wanted to play because when's the last time you think that little kid saw a, another kid? I mean, think about it. Well, who knows? Yeah. I think we should take them with toys. Maybe we should. Maybe we should get like a toy ball to start taking to locations where we know that there's kid spirits. 
Yeah, Maybe have like a little bag that's got like <coughs> toys in it just for that reason. <coughs> yep. And, um, well, you know, we do stuff like that. We, we took things to the little girl at the Trevitt Clinic. Majesty. Yeah, we took I we took, took that the teddy bear to Sarah at the mansion. At the mansion, which and it was completely gone, wasn't it? Yeah, the that teddy, teddy bear, bear was gone. gone. And uh, y'all know who Sarah is when we talk no, about Sarah. Actually, no, because I think we were. That was the night we were there with Bobby. It was, that, but that's not the night. Yeah, yeah, that's the no, that's not the night we took it. Yeah. Was it? Because we'd only been there twice. Yeah, well, three times because we I screwed remember, the first video up. We had to go back and I remember and we stopped and got it on the way because we yeah, had to run to the dollar right. store. Yeah, that's right. That's right. We did. So, uh, I mean, that's just what we do, you know. And, uh, you know, I grew up around kids my whole life. I got slews and nephews and nieces and stuff. And like I said, to us, it's important. If we're doing something and a kid has a, a high interest in it, then I think we should introduce them to it. And... I mean, so far we got the littlest ghost hunters. We haven't done nothing with them in a while. We do want to do something with them, and uh, actually, we've been kicking around the idea about possibly doing another kids paranormal day, and uh, we may do that in November. We'll see. We need to get up with the littlest ghost hunters and their folks and talk to them, and we'll act, we'll certainly include Krista and Kylie. And, uh, well, you know what really know. tripped me out about Kylie, though? What really tripped me out is she was interested also not just the aspect of the investigation and the stuff that we were using. She was interested in the camera. Yeah, she was interested in how the camera worked. I and think, I think we need to get to her off. <coughs> I do think that. And um, so I'm really proud of her, you know, and I can't brag enough about her okay. professionalism. And, uh, I mean, I might be wrong. I don't know if she's, I can't remember how old she is. She's either 9 or 10. And, um, so she's amazing. And you know what I saw I on TikTok 12. this morning? I saw a video that she did on TikTok, and she had her Wolf and Hound shirt on. I thought she was 12. No, dude, she's not 12. And, I mean, I don't uh, think so. Either way, Jim, the older that girl gets, the older my ass feels. You know, the crazy thing is, too, is the more she looks like her mama. So uh -huh. anyway, so yeah, so we wanted to brag on her oh, a little that's, bit. That's their mama's girl right there. That's oh yeah, that and sure. uh, that girl, that kid, out of all the kids on this earth, that little girl right there has the full protection of wolf and hound. If somebody ever did something to her, yeah, they'd see hell. Yeah, coming. yeah, we're gonna bring we'll bring hell to whoever's doorstep. I can promise you, cause. <laughs> That little girl is, I've been around her her whole entire life. I remember when her mama called and told me she was pregnant. I was working at the horse farm. And we were out in the middle of that field sitting on the gator when her mama called me and told me she was pregnant. I was pretty happy about it because I knew now I was going to have another buddy, you know. So, um, oh, yeah, and I don't want to forget Bladen. He was with us, too, and uh, he was pretty good, wasn't he? Bladen was. I'd love to have him come back on an investigation with us. Um, he was really good. Oh, this is the, the pancake one. Oh. The rest of the beans and beer are on the way. Risky choice of meal, chili on a first date. Don't worry, they're going to have a blast. <clears throat> so, I should put um, that in the video. <laughs> Um, I think that's about it. <coughs> yeah, I don't really have anything else to talk about right now. Yeah, me either. Um, you know, anyway, um, so, you know, it's spooky season. And, uh, I think I, I want to go do a trail this year. <coughs> that sounds pretty good. I think I, I would like to go do a haunted trail. And I think it, it, it's one of the two spots. It's either going to be the scream, uh, the scream dream one. It's like 50 plus rooms in a basement of an abandoned factory. Yeah. It's supposed to be like your worst 
damn near all of your worst nightmares in each one of them. I mean, really, around. how scary is that? I mean, we're paranormal investigators. We we go into these places I mean, that it, have it, real ghosts. It, it clearly yeah. says not to go there if you have, like, mental conditions, health issues, stuff oh, like shit, that. Oh, shit, I'm going anyway. Uh, <laughs> uh, fuck uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, fuck that. I always got to tone my mental skills. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. I want to talk about, too, uh, I just hope it's not one of them hand buttons. You know what I want to talk about now? It, don't, it doesn't say. It's not. You have to sign a waiver. Uh, I have uh, signing that waiver. But listen, let me tell you something. Um, I forgot what the fuck I was going to say. Okay, well, let's, let's rewind here. So you, I was talking about... Uh, I'm fucking stoned already. Green Dreams Place. I guess that's the name of it. I'll go back and look. But... You, then you just said you were wanting to talk about something, and then you just kind of went blank. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, you went blank. Yeah, I want to talk about um, where we're going to do our Halloween video. And um, yeah, I think that should be a surprise. I think it should be, too. So, we won't say nothing. So, I guess let's not talk about that after all. Nope. Um, Heck, y'all just got clickbaited. Yeah, so of course, you know, we were going to do the, the drawing and the, the raffle, and somehow or another that just that got completely screwed over, so yeah, we, just we just decided to not do it. Um, I think what we that will... That don't mean we're not going to do it. What we're going to do gonna in December, in I think, future. is we are going to do a random... Uh, I think way more in the future than December. Wow. Well, just so we can make sure we have enough time to get all that. Oh, no, I'm not talking about doing a raffle. Yeah, that's pretty much a done thing. Oh, done. we're just going to pick a random I think person. what we're going to do is sometime in December, we're going to do like we did last year, and we're going to pick uh, two random people to send uh, Wolf and Hound Christmas presents to. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think I got somebody in mind, and we'll, I got we'll think somebody of it. In mind. So, um,. We might be thinking about the same person, but I don't know. But we'll see how that goes. And uh, no, I don't need no whisper. Ain't gonna catch it. Uh, yeah. Yep. And uh, I, I didn't like, fucking hear nothing. Either. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so and, I think uh, we are kind of on the right page. See, that's what I like about doing though. the Christmas thing. We don't have to do a draw, a random uh, drawing. We just get to choose. And, uh, uh, so, yeah, yeah. See, that's, I think we are on the same page. And um, actually, we might do three. I don't know yet, but we might. And um, so y'all have that to look forward to. I think that's something that we should do every Christmas. I really do. And... Um, you know, that kind of gives back, and it gives something personal to the people that we choose, and, uh, but, yeah. You're so rude. Yeah, shut the fuck up, finally. Shh. Anyway, but we are in their house, so we, we'll we should probably And they're crow. probably tripping on us. Yeah, I, we'll I probably mean, wind up getting into a shish and mess with the crows. Maybe. That's going to be fun. Can I hit that? No. Oh, did I mention that, uh... Oh, you're a fat man. No. Um, so you know, I have I have discovered I have some some health issues, <clears throat> and uh, which I guess one of them can be pretty serious. Um, so I just I gotta, you know, a wise person once you know taught me something about accountability. <coughs> well, and, you know, taking care of myself. To be and, fair and honest, I, I think we both may have some health issues. Yeah. Uh, well, we haven't been taking very good care of ourselves lately. We've been eating a lot of junk, a lot of stuff that goes in the microwave. I mean, but it's not as easy for us to just to cook a meal as it once was, you know. So we do what we can, you know. And and in no way am I saying that I'm not satisfied with that. I'm satisfied with every little thing that I have because I have had times in my life when I've had absolutely nothing. And uh, so I'm grateful for what we do have. Uh, we have a pretty good life. <clears throat> we actually have good people around us all the time. And, you know, no matter whatever goes on, if something's wrong or I need advice or I just need somebody to, to, to lay something down on, man, you know what I'm saying? We have people around us who are willing to hear us. 
And that says a lot, man. That speaks a lot. And, uh, you know, so I'm not going to mention their names, but I think everybody pretty much knows who I'm talking about. And they, she's a wonderful, she's a wonderful lady. And I'm personally glad to have her in my life. You know what I'm saying? And she, and it's really weird too because she actually is probably one of the smartest people that we know. And she came into our lives exactly when we needed somebody like her to come into our lives. You know what I'm saying? And so that, that's not coincidence. You know, and now look, because of her, now we have another individual that's in our life that we really admire and we look up to and <coughs> we like hanging out with. You know, who's just as crazy as we are. And, um, I mean, if I take you on a paranormal investigation with me, that means I like you. Because other than that, I probably, I, I wouldn't take you if I didn't care much for you. So that's got to say something. And he's been twice now. And uh, so he's good people, man. And I hope he's going to be in our life for a long, long, long time to come. And, uh, and he's actually introducing us to a whole new world. I mean, it's slow, slow as we go. But we're actually be getting introduced to something that we never thought we'd be introduced to. And that's cool, man. It's, I love to see other perspectives of other worlds. You know what I mean? That only educates you, right, Hound? So, hey, Hound. You know something really tragic happened yesterday and uh, and so Bill uh, just yeah and it's it's words. yeah it really is and I've been in contact with this person and uh, and she's gave us her full blessing so we're doing this under her guidance and her blessing but I'd like to say, you know, um, yesterday, you know, Chan, Canadian witch, lost her mother suddenly. And it was a shock and it was a heartbreak. And I just want Chan to know that you're not alone. You know, we, we just went through this not long ago and we know how it feels. There's others here that's gone through similar things so you're definitely not alone. And uh, I wanted to tell you that we love you. We do. And uh, we're here if you need us. And, uh, you know, I, I gave her my phone number. Not a whole lot of people has my phone number. She does now. And uh, so I'll make sure it's out right here. I want to, we want to, uh, we knew this is something that we were going to do this morning. So we want to dedicate the Wolf and Hound in the Deep Woods video to Chan's mom and to Chan. <clears throat> and uh, just to let you know that we love you and that we offer our deepest condolences to you and your family. So if we could, if we could for just a moment have a few moments of silence as we reflect on life and those that we've lost.
trying to get it to snort back to me. Staying quiet so you wouldn't scare her away. Wolf got really close. That's nuts. I didn't want to move. I just wanted to taste the kitten right here. So I wouldn't turn the camera and scare it away. <clears throat> I'll come back over here once. So that was our memorial to Chan's mom her. So, now we love you, Chan. We do. And uh, it was our honor to do this for you and for the memory of your mom. So. Man, wasn't that freaking cool how close that deer let me get to it? Augie, I was within, look, there it is again, look, it came right back again. <coughs> and uh, it has no fear of us. Big deer too. Yeah, I walked right up on it, dude, I was like three feet away from it. I did, but it was, when I got a little too close, it got scared, but, uh, so that was pretty cool, which I'll be sure to uh, put the I'm deer, right, I'll be, it. listen, I'll be sure, we'll be sure to add the deer footage in to this. Oh. Uh, So what do you think about these woods, Hal? I like them. Me peaceful. too. And um, it is peaceful. And it's something I, I definitely around. needed to be Take out here. me a walk around and see if I can maybe find a turkey feather somewhere. Yeah. All these pine needles. Look, it's coming over here. Come here. And uh, so. I wonder if it's something to eat. I don't know, man. Um. So that's all I really have to say here, Hal. Um, I mean, I wasn't prepared for what I was wanting to talk about. You know, it's always just random with us. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, we'll yeah. Here, talk about random stuff. Yeah. And I do want to tell you that I do want to say I want to thank all the people who subscribe to our channels, who watch our videos, who interact with us. We love you. You're really important to us. And uh, when something happens to one of you, you know, it does affect us, and um, it affects us emotionally. And so, um, that's just who we are, I guess. So, with that being said, um, I think that we're going to shut the camera down, and we're going to head out. Actually, I'm probably going to hang around here for just a little bit more. Yeah. And then we're going to hang out. Damn, that freaking deer yeah. came back. I got it. I got it. My turn to get close. We don't have much in the cold house.
Come well, on, you can come with me. I should grab some of my biscuits. You're going to biscuit too. I just want to see if it'll, it'll actually. to get close to the deer and it's just going to come back and uh, you know, that's pretty amazing that this wild animal let us get this close to it so yeah in Rowan County deers look at you they run like for the hills this deer didn't seem to care and I'm thinking this is the same deer we saw over there so this might be where they live they hang out right here uh, which, put it this way uh, oh you can't see uh, hold on I'll adjust it Put it this way, is when the deer in Rowan County out there in them woods see you, it's like they start running and then all you hear is the Iron Maiden song, Run to the hills, right? Run for your life. Right? Yeah. And uh, yeah, they haul ass. But yeah, this, they do. this deer here, I mean, this deer let me get close enough that I take, I took some awesome cell phone video of it and yeah, look there she is again right there look she's just watching us looking at us she has no fear of us come here baby come on come on come on next time i'm gonna go for a single and uh i bet you i can get closer uh, you gotta be careful with wild animals hound and uh so anyway i guess uh, this is going to conclude our sitting on this log. Of course, we're going to film some more going back down the trail and stuff. And then, um, or wherever else we decide to explore. And, uh, so, oh, I know what I wanted to talk about now, Hound. I know what I wanted to talk about now. Uh, I want to talk about how we are going to try to start building up the Carolina Boy Rail Fans channel. And, uh, start doing more stuff with that okay. and because uh, we need to man it's been what two months since we even put a video on there I think in the last video I put on there was actually a short I kind of forgot about that too, so, to be honest. well you shouldn't forget about it and we're not going to forget about it so we're going to actually start doing some work and trying to build it up some um, I mean trains are one of my train things videos, uh, so that's usually how it goes. So, so we're going to be doing that. So oh, uh, she's back over there now. Yeah, she was cool. She was a cool deer. So I guess we're going to shut this camera off, and then the next time you see us, we'll be heading back through the woods and getting back on the trail and headed back towards the truck. Um, thank you for listening to yeah. our ra ramblings and. Um, I just want to, you know, once again tell Canadian witch that you know we, we love, love her, <clears throat> and that um, you know I, I don't even know what to say at this point. I, I don't even think I want to talk about that anymore because it just I'm, I'm just still in shock. It makes me sad. So, but anyway, so let's let's do before we cut the camera off, Hound. Let's do something. Let's are sing a song gonna, we haven't sang. Are you gonna do? Uh, I'm a cowboy. Nope. I'm a cowboy. No, I'm not going to do I'm a cowboy. Yeah. I'm a cowboy. Yeah, I'm not doing any of that. Uh, yeah, you should. That'd be funny as hell. But I want to, uh, you know what I want to sing? Some Neil Young. Oh, no. Yeah. So, I'll let you start it out. Nah. I'll start it out. Ready? Reaching out. Touching you. 
sing it with me. Touching me, sweet Caroline. Dun dun dun. The good, good times it. never seem so always called. good. Uh, I'm uh. feeling fine. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Look, we got an audience. The deer. Uh, the deer's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, yeah, the deer's like, what are y'all crazy people doing? Hey, baby, what is it? Come over here. Come on. Come here. Come here. She was watching. She's watching us. Come here. Come here. She knows, look, she knows her ears ain't even laid back or nothing, man. She's, she's got them up. She's watching yeah. us. She's sniffing the air. She's watching us. That's pretty cool. Maybe I can swing the camera around real quick. Show everybody that we do have an audience here. He's right there. He's right there. I got it zoomed in. Pretty good. You can see her. She's right there. Come here, baby. Come on. <laughs> Dude, this is so freaking cool, man. This is almost as cool as the time I shared my marshmallows with that raccoon at Lake Norman State Park that time. But that's pretty cool right there. See you, babe. See you, babe. Okay. Uh awesomeness the wilderness is dude for real <sighs> see if you guys that way a little more okay so I guess that was fun wasn't it dude that just is something that does not happen every freaking day so like she's not even scared of she's us. She's not at even all. scared of us. She keeps I mean when I got like within three feet of her, she just trotted off over to that tree. She well, turned Jenny around and stopped me and she came right hell. back. Yeah. She's not raising hell. We seen that other one too. There's a littler one around here and I bet that the little one's probably right around here somewhere. But uh I mean that's just awesome. I love nature, dude. I just I probably love it. Probably where we can't and, uh, yeah, that could be anywhere over here. Jesus Christ. Anywhere. So anyway, um I guess we're going to cut this off, and like I said, the next time you see us, we'll be on the trail heading back to the truck. Um, and uh, we may stop and shoot a little something. Of course, this video might be a little on the long side, but, you know, we can just deal with that or whatever. All right. Well, peace. <laughs>
That's the way we come. I think so the trail's on up. Probably some kind of. Look, that looks like some type of old foundation. I bet, there was a, I bet at one time there was a house here that was a roof over. Probably. I'm gonna go down here. Dude, you know what would be awesome? This would be an awesome spot to do a necrophonic. Yeah, or a necrophonic. time around yeah well there's a, another place right over there I'm not really sure what these are well, I wonder if they were like mining I don't know I don't know either See, there's more rocks. I'm not going to go too far up this trail. I just want to see where it goes. this just a second I'm gonna look at the map let's see where we are yeah because it looks like there's an intersecting trail right here trail yeah pine thicket is two uh, point two miles um, got something in my eye. okay well we decided that we're gonna take this pine thicket trail and Eventually, we're going to have to leave the trail and go back through the woods to connect on another trail. Um, so, I guess let's go down this way. The Pine Thicket Trail right here. Holy shit, I wasn't, nice expect going, I wasn't expecting that to happen. <laughs> nice going, look what you did. Yeah. And that, they, I caught it on video. They should, they should, hey, look, they should have down... Uh, they should have used the they, bracket right? Yeah, they should have put a screw in it or something. Or a bracket. 
That was kind of lame. Actually. I know, and I, and I caught it on video. Dude, can you believe that deer? No. I just that's that was like the highlight of my whole month, man. Was that deer hanging Can't out? Can't believe that how stuff. close let you me, got. Let to me it. get that close to it, so I could film it with my cell phone. Hello, pine tree. Hello, pine tree. I guess this is still the orange trail, or yep. red trail. Red trail. Make sure you get that. Red trail. Red trail. We're on what? Red, green, and white. Yeah, I think so. I think. I love it out here, dude. It's so... Don't this kind of remind mm -hmm. you of the AT? Yeah. It does. I'll oh, check out the little canopy we got to walk under. I know. I wonder how many heads we got busted on this one. Red trail. That's a dog whip. <laughs> dog. Yeah, the sad view. Damn, Wolf, you didn't have to leave a log like that. Knowing you always like to poop next to stuff. Well, I do like to poop next to stuff. I mean, that's no big deal. I mean, I'm a wolf after all. We do poop to mark our territory. Well, I don't poop to mark my territory. That's what the P is for. I, I like pee on my territory. Man. This place is pretty extraordinary. Oh look, there's another big gully or yeah, hole where it is. Out, maybe water run down or something. Who knows, dude? We got people coming. So, yeah. Yeah. How's it going? Good. Hey, we're filming a YouTube video. So if you don't want to be on YouTube, you tell me now, we'll edit you out of it. He had a pretty dog. Yeah. I mean, you may just see like a split second. But well, we if, if, even if it's a split second, we gotta edit it out. Because we asked him, he said he didn't. He didn't want to be on the video. So we have to respect that. Yep. I'm not sure, but I'm just saying it may be a split second. See where we're at. Oh, let's just go down here. There's a, there's a trail going I know, just hold on. I think this is where we gotta go. So keep talking to the camera. Okay, well, Hound's checking the Google map of the trail, and uh, so he's gonna see. Yep, we that's exactly where we gotta go. Go down this way? Nope. There's straight, a trail right there. Straight, look. straight across. Yeah, straight through there. the trail goes right down this way. Look. Yeah, well, I see we it. gotta go this way. So we'll be right. Because the trail goes back up around that. I know, I see where the trail goes. And this goes down and back up that way. Well, I can only do what, what I got. Here. I'll film it. Oh, yeah, well, that's what happens when we... 
And that's what happens when we bushwhack. Oh, uh, spider web in the base. This is exactly where we started. Right here. So we could have just came right down this way. Look, there's that ridge. Awesome sauce. Alright, come stand behind me. We'll, we'll do that at the truck. Well, I think uh, we're going to go ahead and shut the camera off. And uh, we're not too far away from the truck. So we're going to shut this off. And uh, once we get up to the truck, you know, we'll do our closing remarks and blah, blah, blah. Yep. So, we'll all right. Blah, blah, blah. We got to well, blah, blah, blah. So. Yeah. So we'll see you when we get back to the truck. Peace. All right. Come on. All right. Well, we made it back to the truck. Um, these trails are phenomenal here. And... Uh, Dude, the deer, the, the deer, deer just, was... that deer, man, was like watching us the whole time. I was able to get within three feet of it. It would trot but off. But you should have saw that in the video. Yeah, you saw that in the video. That's pretty cool. Plus, you know, I got a couple shorts that I put on, on our short videos about it. Uh, it was pretty cool. This place is awesome. I love the trails here. They go winding around deep into those woods out here. Uh, I can't wait to come back and see what it looks like here when all the fall colors are here. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, it's starting. Um, That's for sure. Where we are now is uh, on the other side of this bridge that we fished on. I'll see if I can show you. Perhaps. Right over there is where me and Hound fished about a month ago and we caught a couple little catfish and stuff so it was pretty cool so uh, I guess Hound's preoccupied doing something else Sorry. so I oh, guess with that being you. said I want to thank you guys for watching and uh, we absolutely dedicate this video to Canadian Witch and the memory and legacy of her mom and uh, and I think with that being said we're going to roll on out and head to the house. Much peace. love and peace.